In today's video we will be discovering some of the deepest secrets of Marina Trench. As we all know, oceans covers about 71% of Earth's surface. They surround us and yet, they are largely unknown. Not too long ago we thought, Earth was flat and boring. We now know they are anything, and there's so much more to discover. If you have never been into the deepest parts of the oceans, well, today is the day to explore incredible Mariana Trench. In these depths thousands of meters below is a world of complete darkness. The Mariana Trench was found in the Western Pacific Ocean. Which is the deepest part located in the ocean? The trench sits like a crescent-shaped dent in the floor of the Pacific Ocean. Extending over 1,500 miles long, with an average width around 43 miles. And a depth of almost 7 miles. At that depth, the weight of all that water above, makes the pressure in the trench around, 1,000 times higher than it would be in New York. When was it discovered? The Mariana Trench was first pinpointed in 1875, during the undertaking of a global circumnavigation. It was found by utilizing sounding equipment on the HMS Challenger. And it was named after the nearby Mariana Islands. Do things live there? Yes. Despite the lack of light and the hostile acidic conditions in the trench, a surprising number of organisms live there. There are more than 200 known microorganisms and small creatures that live there. Researchers have discovered a giant amoeba about 10 centimeters in diameter. Although new species as old as the dinosaurs, some of them have not been identified to date. Most of the creatures that live in the depths of the Mariana Trench are fed by one another or by the dead rain. Another question you might want to ask, why is the Mariana Trench so deep? The depth of the Mariana Trench is controversial, however, the question of its deepness causes many interests. Answering this, why is the Mariana Trench so deep? This question is as difficult as diving into the Mariana Trench. However, according to the researchers, the trench was formed millions of years ago, due to sliding tectonic plates. According to National Geographic, if you were to put Mount Everest at the bottom of the Mariana Trench, its peak would still sit around 7,000 feet below sea level. If you enjoyed this video and want to hear from me again, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Thanks for watching, I will see you in the next video.